Hi everyone welcome to Coco Senor today I will teach how to make portable windows on USB with Coco Senor OS2 Tuner. Coco Senor Zero S2 Tuner is a professional Windows to go creator that enables users to create portable windows on non-certified USB drives, regardless of the Windows editions and versions. Part 1 How to make portable windows on a USB drive by using PE file. Open the program and you can see two options on the home screen. Now connect the USB drive to your computer. After that, choose the Use PE File option. Now select the USB drive to continue. You can directly hit the option, Use the native PE file to create the bootable PE. Or you can select the option, Download the PE file online to download the PE file and store on your computer. OK, now everything is ready. You can click the Start button to make PE. Hit Yes to format the USB drive. Well, the PE is successfully created. Close the software and then restart the computer. You need to set it to boot from your USB drive. OK, you can see, the software runs automatically to burn the windows on your USB drive. When the successful prompt comes, you can close the software and shut down PC. You can take this USB to boot on any Windows OS and directly run into the Windows. Just plug the portable Windows USB into a Windows computer. Then restart the computer and boot it from the USB drive. See, you directly enter the same working environment as your own computer. Part 2 How to make portable windows on a USB drive by using image file. Connect the USB drive to your computer. Open the computer and select the use image file option. Select your USB. OK, now click the folder icon to choose the ISO image file from your computer. After that, the software will decompress the image file for you. You can select the operating system and click the Start button to proceed. Hit Yes to format the USB drive.
Minutes later, the portable system is burned into the USB. You can boot any Windows computer with the USB and then run the clean Windows OS. Just plug the Windows to go USB into the computer. Restart your computer and set it to boot from the USB. All right, follow the steps to install the Windows system on the USB. Finally, you get into the clean Windows system. That's all. Thanks for watching.